welcome to my channel so it's my third attempt to the author top 10 d4 d4 challenge let's see first let me connect to my vpn connecting let me fire up the machine let's see if we can ping this after some time let's see let's wait this is my Tom let him for your information this is the part 2 of day 4 we have already completed the four taxes tax and this is and, and only one is remaining so let's see this is the fifth day of the so we'll be doing fifth day also maybe but i'll post this tomorrow so we we, we got paying message from the day four machine so i've told you to read this xxs e payload this is very important payload for us we'll be working in this so if you can see i am just logging in this machine which is not responding i don't know what to do let's see if i can fire this by this nope what do we have to do with this to fire up i think it's pinging it is connected is it connected why it is not listed here is it because oh it's done let's see takes some sometimes to load sometimes like really long times to so we have discovered that this line is the prologue of the uh, XML prologue of this uh, XML language. So we'll be using the payload in this section. So you have two payloads. This shows the username of the system. If we submit button, then we'll go to file configuration. This is the username. This is the username of the machine. Let me write it. So the next one, let me go to the try. Let's see. Let me make one directory of D4. And let's go to D4. Let's name it username. Let's go to detail. .txt. Let's paste it here. Falcon fist Let's save it. So we got the username. So you write uh, using this using this payload, we can also print out our own name. So for that we should this we should this is how this represents our last name and this this falcon represent our first name if you if we modify this we can print our name in this falcon fist address let's see see we we, we are able to print our own name so what is this now this is the this is the advanced this is the advanced advanced type of XML payloads. It's the same as this, but in this we are using root root, and we are reading the etc slash password file. If you don't know what it, what is etc slash password file contain, you can look here. It contains etc. I'm sorry for my typing mistakes. So it is it is the path where all the user credentials 
and their permissions permission and their paths are located so using this payload we can we can we, we can we can what to we can just see the users credentials and machines machines all details here so if you submit this we can get this so here it is this there is one one root user and there is other one falcon user so as we know we already had our add our that falcon user where was my directory let's see so, so we have we had our falcon fist user so here it is the falcon fist user which is a user so we are in the last tax so try to display your own name we are we have already done that see if you can read the read the password file so we can we can read this using this payload so what is the name of the user in it is a password the username is falcon 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 so where is the falcon sss located so 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 we have to know that where sss key are located so we know that there is only one user there is no other user than falcon these all are the these all demons demons and others are just are services there is only two user that is root user and the falcon user let's see where sss key are located for that i'll just google it sss location If you can see, you can just find it here somewhere here. See here, enter the file name. You can see the SSS STR located in the ID RSA. So RSA are the encryption types. If you are, if you are, if you are have some knowledge about cryptocurrency, you will know that the RSA is the what is RSAR is this the re reverse semi rattle name so SSS key are stored in names using this using this location we can find we can see the Falcon SSS key located so let's see if we can able to find our Falcon's key SSS location let's see let modify this text into file home slash falcon slash dot sss slash id underscore rsa let's submit this see we we got out the beginning rsa file let's save it as rsa file let's go to our directory let's make a document empty document i recommend you to do this by command so i'll just save it so where was the location so it was in the it was in the home slash username that is falcon slash dot sss slash sss slash id underscore isa so we got the answer right the what are the first 18 characters of falcon so as we know i'm sorry for this as we know when we execute this payload this read payload into the directory of home slash 
um, slash file one that is the username slash dot sss slash id underscore rsa we got the encryption time so in the question we are asked to what are the first characters so we we have this key we can do what we can just sort cut it out in the 18 character for that we have command for that we have command cut let's see if you can do that let's see let's first echo the file echo the text in this and cut it cut it into 18 byte I don't think we got it. I think there is a pipe missing here. So we got it. So we got 18, 18 character. Let's submit this. And let's drink out this. So day 4 is also completed. Wait for the day 5. Thank you for watching.